Hi, it's Caroline from Bark, and today we're going to talk about how to set up parental controls on YouTube Kids. To get started, you'll want to create a Google Family Link account. Simply visit the Google homepage and click Gmail. Next, click Create an Account and enter in your child's first and last name, create an email, username, and a password. Next, you'll enter in month, day, and year of your child's birthday, as well as their gender. Because your child is under the age of 13, it will ask that you link their Gmail account to your Gmail account. Next, Google will ask that you verify your child's information, so confirm that it's correct and click Next. Take a look at the parental consent information as well as the terms and agreements and click Agree. From the Google Play Store, download the Google Family Link app onto your device as well as your child's device. In this demo, we will walk through how to set up Google Family Link on your child's device. However, you will need to follow similar prompts on your own device. Enter in your child's email to confirm that this is the account that you will be setting up under your Family Manager account. Google will ask you to confirm your email. At this point, you can review the Google settings for your child's device. Next, you'll need to install Google Family Link Manager. Choose a relevant name for your child's device. Next, you'll be able to review the apps on your child's device and make changes to the settings. Next, follow the prompts to activate Family Link Manager. You may review and make changes to the settings. After following the prompts, your devices are now connected. After you've installed YouTube Kids from the Google Play Store, launch the app. Next, based on the age and maturity level of your child, choose what content level is appropriate. One of the most important settings that you will need to decide on is whether or not to allow your child to search for additional videos. If you choose Search On, your child can search for new videos that interest them from the millions available in the YouTube Kids app. However, if you choose Search Off, you limit your child to videos from a set of channels that have been verified by YouTube Kids, and your child cannot search for videos. If you'd like to make changes to additional settings, click the gear icon in the bottom right-hand corner of your screen. You may also choose to manage YouTube Kids from Google Family Link. Visit families.google.com slash families. Click on the child whose device you have just set up. Next, scroll down and click More. On the next screen, scroll to the bottom of the page and click YouTube Kids. From here, you can make changes to the search function as well as the content level settings that were discussed in the previous segment. If your child will be watching YouTube Kids from your device, here's how to set it up. First, the app will prompt you to enter in the year that you were born. Next, the app will go through a short video to explain more. You may also choose to review this information in a text format. Next, sign in with your parent account. Review the parental consent information and then confirm by entering in your email and password. Now you can create a profile for your child by entering in their first name, age, and birth month. Based on your child's age and maturity level, you can choose what types of videos your child can view. The app is now ready for your child to use. However, if you would like to make changes to the settings, 
click the lock in the right hand corner of your screen. To confirm that you are the parent, the app will prompt you to answer a simple math problem. Next, you can choose a time limit for your child to use the app. You may also make updates to additional parental controls by clicking Settings. At this point, it's a good idea to create your own four-digit passcode in case your child is able to easily answer the math problems. From now on, the app will prompt you to enter in that passcode instead of answering a math question. In August 2019, YouTube Kids was given its own dedicated website. Your child may now view videos on YouTubeKids.com. Once you've entered the site, click Get Started. To confirm that you are a parent, the website will prompt you to answer a math problem. Please review the notice to parents and click I agree. Next, based on the age and maturity level of your child, choose what content level is appropriate. Next, you will choose if you will allow your child to search on YouTube Kids or if you will turn that function off. The website will then walk you through a couple of additional features. To make updates to the settings, click the icon in the top right hand corner of your screen. Especially if you have older children, we recommend that you create a custom passcode so that your child cannot make changes to parental control settings by simply answering a math problem correctly. In addition to setting parental controls on your child's device, the next safety layer parents should strongly consider is a monitoring solution to assess the content their kids encounter and produce online. By monitoring text messages, YouTube, emails, and more than 24 different social networks for potential safety concerns such as cyberbullying, self-harm, violence, sexual predators, and more, Bark allows busy parents to rest easier knowing that their kids are better protected from digital dangers. To learn more or sign up, visit bark.us.